is a special place because this has been the center of the war for the Lost Resistance Army, mm. and it is a place where a lot of children suffered so so much from abduction, from killing. Mm. Some also died because they were abducted, mm. and especially women and girls. Mm. A lot of them were abducted, some turned into sex slaves, mm. and when they come back, a lot of them are in turn. A lot of them have been moving around, but the worst of all. Most of these children were rejected by their own families, by the society, by the people. Mm. And this a time I started feeling St. Monica could be a special place where these girls can be accepted to come as they are, come with their children and be here, take some vocational skills training. It's not only about studies, it's about rehabilitating yourself and starting life. My emphasis is on women and children. With children, I look to a future generation mm. and with the mothers who lost their education, mm. who lost their family, who lost their childhood, they can restart. Mm. We can start now mm. to look towards the future. Say, I have been with the really invisible children right here for years, mm. and of course, I can call them invisible children because many people even don't know that we have all these girls and children here. Mm. And many people even do not know that we still have girls who escape from captivity mm. with a lot of wounds in their hearts. Mm. Girls with children, girls who have been seeing, dancing and being entertained, mm. these are all formerly abducted girls. Wow. And they're all child mothers. Wow. And for me, these are the real invisible children. And we must raise awareness about the presence of these girls and what they should hope for. Mm. Just what we see exactly. Mm. If Coin is arrested now, if anything happens now, what next are we doing with the children who are right in our hands? Mm. What next are we doing about the girls? Mm. This film is not real about the, the, the I mean, Coin himself. Mm. The film is supposed to focus a lot on the people who have been together with coin, mm. people who have been the product of this conflict. Mm. What are we doing for them? Mm. What are our plans for them? That's what the world should hear. And if coin is arrested, it will give a kind of illusion to many people that the war is over. But what about the people who have been in this war for all these years? Is it over? Are they already healed? Are they rehabilitated? What are we doing with them? These are the people I would wish people should focus attention and give support, help them to look towards future, help them to walk, looking into the future, help these children to be a future generation of a different group of people in Uganda. <laughs> In fact, if people want to help St. Monica, I would encourage that they go to the website of Pros for Africa, Professionals for Africa, because this is an organization which was funded to support St. Monica and all the activities, all the children. That's why you see us having so many of them, and we are going out to find where they are. We don't want them to get discouraged that people are not supporting them. So if people want to give us help, they go to website of Pros for Africa. It is a 501c3 and they will send all the money to us as soon as we need it. Right. I would be very grateful for any support. All Thank right. you. Thank you so much, sister. Yeah.